be easier if you send me the challenge after your this battle. Because have you changed the screen? Yep, I just fixed it. Alright. Alright, Reshram on the bench. Now the only thing I really wish is if it didn't if the muscle band added twenty damage to attacks where it was like collect, draw a card with no damage. That'd be kinda funny. So let's put a fire energy on him. Let's buff our Reshrim. We'll keep the other muscle band in our hand. And we'll end our turn. Fortunately, we couldn't collect on our first turn, which kind of sucks. On the plus side, I can burn him next turn, so that actually works really well with the Simus here. I'd rather have the other one to draw more cards early, but... We can actually start powering up Reshiram and doing damage to him without actually taking damage too much. So let's do that. And Searing Flame. Oh, I should have put the Muscle Band on for an extra 20 damage. Oh well. The burn will help. Oh, that freaked me. That freaked me out. I thought there was a spider climbing on my leg. <laughs> it was just my it's cord from my speaker thing. hitting against my leg, and I was like, eh. not a spider person. Yeah. A lot of people aren't. Yeah, that's true. Nope, he's pulling his energy off. Oh boy, it's that drill bird. That thing is nasty. I think it does so much damage. Which one? It's a uh, drill bird. Or X X Excel drill. It has oh, reinforced drill, one. which can do eighty if he has a tool card on it, and then seventy otherwise. Yeah, that's the. Oh, he's using a basic deck. Mm. He's using basic fighting. No, it's a custom one because it was a custom challenge. Otherwise, it wouldn't let me oh, be using yeah. the blue flare deck. Um. Yeah, you can sometimes. All right. Let's see what Pokemon are in. Let's get a Tepig. Or maybe he just cloned it. Down the, on deck. the bench. Yeah, yeah he, he might have cloned it. Him. And let's get a pig knight. Ugh, still no... Oh, I have a professor's ladder, so I can get energy. And let's make this guy absolutely obnoxious. Let's put the rock guard on him so he stays longer. <laughs> and we'll put a muscle band on the tepig. And that should be good. He failed the coin flip, so I kill him. It's a mix of destruction, rush, and some packs, apparently. Oh, tarantulas I'm fine with. It's the little spiders you can't see that I don't like. Big spiders are fine. I hate sp I'm a I have arachnophobia. I don't do spiders at all. It's the little spindly, stick-legged ones that are creepy as shit. I had one run across my hand when I was in a rental park. So now he has to take, make a choice. Does he want to do 50 damage to me, but take 60 damage back? Or does he want to leave me alone? <laughs> That's what I really like about the rock guard. And now the rock guard's gone. <laughs> oh, yeah. That rock guard card. Wow, he I... actually... Uh, there was a little bit of a misplay there. That tool scrapper can remove two tool cards. And he actually didn't remove any of my other tool cards. I remember I accidentally removed one of my own one time. <laughs> Alright, he's got a Crocorot going up. Cool thing is, for like no energy, this card has been like just holding its own. Dang it, I should have made that trade. What trade? Someone offered a Rock Guard for a, a Scoop Up Cyclone. It's an okay card. I think actually the max potion is the more viable long term option. Max potion, you get rid of all your energies on it. No, ma or the gold potion. Oh. Which doesn't. Well, no, someone was offering the rock guard for my scoop up cyclone. Hmm. Now, should I do oh. the 40 damage end burn or hold on to the muscle band? I'll hold on to the muscle band and just do the 20 in the burn. I mean, could you imagine that rock guard on, like, my, uh, Dark Rye EX? Let's see. Flame Charge. <laughs> Search your deck for an energy, fire energy card and attach to this Pokemon. Shuffle your deck afterwards. We could get away with one of those, but I'd rather not. 
I don't have a Switch card. Do I have any Pokemon or Energy in here? Nope. Alright, he's dead. Well, he lasted a while. Well, this unfortunately will cost us a significant amount of energy to use, but I think we're going to have to blue flare out. So we'll attach a fire energy to him. I guess we'll play the Pan Seer. We'll put this on this Tepig. And we'll blue flare. Oh, well, that's good. They finally fixed it in trading that if you have the card, but it's non-trade, it won't show up as trade. Yeah, that, that was a nice fix. Someone wants a full art Sharon for the rock guard, but I... Mine's oh, yeah, the, the, they're, they charge ridiculous amounts. Oh, he's got a... U oh, that's an interesting deck. He's got a combination of dark and fighting. It's pretty good, actually. Good combination. Uh, so let's make sure you keep an eye on how many cards are in your deck left. That are in your deck still. Yeah, the blue flare deck doesn't tend to burn out. Some of my other decks actually have a lot more burnout potential. Mm -hmm. Plus, I can also do this. So we can uh, pull three energy and put them back into my deck. And then I can use Bianca to draw up to six cards, which gets me the stuff I need to actually pull some energy. In addition to that, I can Evo Soda, so I can get my Embor out, which, using its ability, allows me to put additional energy on my Reshiram and keep using the Fire Attack again and again. So now I've got my mechanic of my deck working, so things are going to get rather nasty. All right, there's five energy. It's five energy. One, two, three, four, five. Yep, so I can use two turns with that. So that's enough energy for now, and we'll blue flare. And then we can blue flare whatever he sends in. And some more Sharon cards, nice. This card, this card's amazing. Hmm. Uh, remember those half cards? This card specifically works for them. Reveal top ten cards of your deck. If you reveal both halves of a legend card, put both that card on your bench and attach all energy that you revealed onto that Pokemon. Wow! What the hell is that called? Legend Bucks. Wow. It's a pretty good card. Oh, is it still my turn? Or Oh, damn it! Did you really break... Again. Oh no, he has to choose a replacement Pokemon. That's why it's still my turn. Oh, oh he put a Yvetol in that deck. Mm hmm. Yeah, it's a dark fighting. I mean, a dark fighting without a Yvetol is kind of a interesting deck. Yeah, I've got a Yvetol. You have to I choose a that. replacement. Unfortunately, there's no timers in uh, sent battles with friends. See if you can see that. For a second there, I thought, like, did I not end the turn? Did it glitch out? It kind of lags sometimes when that happens. Yeah. I think he's trying to think of what he can actually do to fix this deck once it gets rolling, and there's not much he can do against it. Because I, even though I just discarded two energy back. cards, I can pull them right back into my hand. And put them right back on my Pokemon. <laughs> I, I, I really like these inner... Oh, there he goes. Yeah, he lagged. Okay. I want to try you. <laughs> A little bit breaking up today. Alright, come on. There we go. Alright, what's he going to do? I think he's going to probably keep powering up the Eva Tall while sacrificing the Crocker Rock. Would seem to make sense. Yep. Can I kill it in one turn? I actually can. So now I'm going to pill the biggest dick move possible. Oh, no, never mind. He put something else on his bench. 
I was going to say, if he only has... He's, like, he's actually got a done sparse. If he only had one thing on the defense, like just escape rope, use my uh, Embor's ability to attach one energy to Panseer, retreat back into Reshiram, and kill his Yvetal right off the bat. But I can't do that now. All right, let's put two more energy on him. And let's start powering up, I guess, the Embor. Actually, wait, did I pull the... No, I didn't. Um... All right, let's power up the M bar a little bit. And I actually misplayed that. I should have attached my double colorless energy as my regular attach for the turn, because then all the fire energy could have been attached anyway, so I would have had one less card in my hand. But whatever. There's 140 damage. And we get a great ball out of it. All right, so we got one more turn where we can blue flare. And what's he going to have against me? Attach a dark energy for one of your bench Pokemon. Flip a coin. So he can do 100 max at me. Oh, okay, he's got to flip a coin to switch me out. But he failed. Does that mean he can't attack at all? Oh, if Tails, damn. Alright, so Reshrim is pretty much dead, so let's not waste any more energy on it. I'm sorry, but I'm getting really annoyed with Sony real fast. Alright, so let's do this. Let's see what we can... Ooh, there's my NT. Entai. So let's put him on the bench. And again, I misplayed that. I should have attached the double colorless first. Uh, put Reshrim down. Put this one down. And, actually, we can kill him either way, with Outrage or Blue Flare. So let's kill it with Outrage so we don't have to attach more energy to use Blue Flare. And this is how the power of the Blue Flare deck. You keep one Reshiram alive, and you're okay. How much of these health he's got? He's got 30 left, and he... Oh god, that second bite is going to wreck me. This Dunsparce is going to do the most damage a Dunsparce has ever, ever done. Oh, he didn't have a second. Oh, he missed the coin flip. My apologies, my friend. I will let your Dunsparce live. Actually, can I... Yeah, I can let his Dunsparce live. It was a noble Dunsparce attempting to wrest victory from the jaws of defeat. Let's see what my final card is. I like playing cards. It's a bad habit. Uh, let's do... Someone requested the Keldeo deck, so we'll do Keldeo. Works for me. And I won the coin toss, so you are more than welcome you to know. go first. God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> I've actually been looking around online trying to figure out what... Um, which cards are better for going, or which kind of deck compositions are better for going first or second? Ooh, sweet! You should build a deck for that ghost. Yeah, and I'm trying to figure it out, but I, I, I've, I've never seen like it used to. Like they've changed the rules on who go, what happens to the person who goes first, like eight times in the history of Pokemon trading card game. And each time it kind of which swung it. Which one was advantageous and which one wasn't? So it's kind of hard to tell. All right, let's see if we can actually get some of the... Yeah, there we go. I kind of got a shit start hand, but that's okay. All right, so let's get Mewtwo powered up, because we need that powered up at least. Um, can we pull any of our other energy out? No, all we have is water. I keep forgetting that it doesn't pull special energies out. All right, well, that's all I can do. Okay, last turn. Yay, I got a actual I actually got another basic. Sweet. And I'm loving that the uh, my uh what's this thing called again? I almost wish I could accept those friend requests and stuff like that while I'm in a game. Uh the 
stadium cards. That's what it is. Oh, that's an evil stunk, eh? Yeah. <laughs> no! <laughs> well, fine then, you know what? <laughs> I'm just going to power up my bench and then kill it. How do you like them apples? You're not doing any any significant amount of damage to me, so... And that's only going to be pulling you, Eve, at all. because I have the damn thing in my hand. I don't know why I just did that. That was kind of pointless. Oh, someone just offered me a private trade. I'll have to go check that out. And since we, oh, god damn it. Oh, well. Come on, double colorless. If I can draw that, I'm okay. Wait, how did you do zero? Oh, call for family. I was thinking... Either you failed all the coin flips and the game just didn't show it out of shame. Oh, no, I was getting two things on my bench. Uh... <laughs> well, unfortunately for you, things are not going to go well. That's okay. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Looks like You're your deck is... You're not going to like what, I ha what comes next turn, Ghost. Let's just leave it at that. Oh, God, it's that Crocker Rock, isn't it? Mm-hmm. It's in my hand. Oh, that was a lot of damage. Well, let's just mm -hmm. reshuffle hands, then. That's Kidding, I don't have any ends. I don't like them. <laughs> I'm like, wait, that's not an end card. <laughs> no, no, it's not. Come on, give me my Blastoise. Show me the Blastoise. That is not a Blastoise. I'll do that. Ooh! Alright, let's see what this thing's damage is. Move an energy attached to the defending Pokemon to one of your opponent's bench Pokemon. That's fine. And hammer in. Well, actually, it's going to be kind of annoying, especially if Keldeo comes out. Yeah. But no energy to power it. And it doesn't have enough attack to kill anything, so that's still okay. Mm hmm For now. I'll start being a little bit of a dick about things. <laughs> oh, really? It only counts as a single energy? The double colorless? Interesting. I guess so. Hmm. I guess it says double colorless energy provides two colorless energies, but it's one energy yeah, card. Hmm. Oh, no, no, no. It does 40. You're resistant to psychic. That's what it's doing. Oh, right, right. I completely skipped that out. All right. So how much energy do we have? We only have one card in there. Well then, let's see what you got. That's okay. Let's go with this one. Alright, and he's got two energy on him. Mm -hmm. So who and should we bring in? Well, technically, I can already attack. Damn. Just a touch short. Uh huh. Ooh. And just what I needed. At least the hard charm protects me from most of that. Mostly. I could have easily switched for free to go. All right. Well, I do have plenty of damage potential on it so far. So let's power up some secondary stuff just to be safe. And finish you off. Okay. Yay, more energy, just what I need. Oh, look at that. What does that do? Oh, it poisoned. Ew, that's not fun. I didn't know it was going to do that. <laughs> oh, well. Why do I have all my energy retrieval cards in my hand? <laughs> I don't know. Well, we need to kill you anyway. Let's get most of the energy cards out of the deck. Oh, 
shit. I forgot about that secondary coin flip effect. All right. Well, that's not very good. That just took a little bit more damage than I needed to. Luckily, the hard charm is okay. actually helping out quite a bit. All right, then, well... Just because I know you'll have to flip a coin to see if it hits. <laughs> Probably the best thing you could have done. That's what I was thinking. And let's just take those energies right back out of the discard pile. Still can't kill you, though. I was 10 damage short. Yep. Ah, oh, I don't want you to get those back. <laughs> yep. I'm back. I wish I had... Dr I'm hoping I get an end in my next hand. I still I have not gotten my Blastoise. Really? <laughs> I think I count that as lucky, I think. Wait, what's your buff? Uh, no weakness. Ah. Plus, it has a dark energy, which means I can recreate it for free. I'm surprised you didn't actually attack me with the poison. I could have. I derped. Because <laughs> that would have made me flip a coin and I had to rush Keldeo back in again. Oh, that helps me out. And that didn't. <laughs> well, it kind of did, actually. That is Sneasel. That's eh, not bad. I have a Weavile in my deck. Somewhere I don't know. Let's see. Who should I attach this energy to? And for those of you asking about Minecraft, remember that Minecraft servers are derping today, so I might not be playing, depending yeah. on whether they can get it back up or not. Yeah, you'll really only need one town map. <sighs> yeah, that's just in case like it's in what it's in the price thing. <laughs> I've had that happen quite a bit. Ah, not quite enough. <laughs> yeah. Let's do this. Make sure I have no cards in my hand beforehand. Oh, you've got a mulligan juniper, I'm assuming. Wanted to grab that out. And let's oh, have a new hand. Yay! That was all just water energy anyway. There's my blast toys. Now you're in trouble. Oh, god damn it. <laughs> Thank you. Hey, you seem to be a little energy starved at the moment. Yeah, a little bit. They're all hiding in my deck. <laughs> Considering I have 16 of them, I'm not getting very many of them. Well, well I know where my war turtles are. Not in the deck. <laughs> They're all in my prize really? cards. <laughs> How many war turtles do you have? Well, let's just uh, not let you recover that. That's okay. And we'll hold on to the water energy this turn, because I'm not sure what's actually going to die. She'll put it on him. Okay. That gives me two cards. Neither of which is going to help me in this situation. Not what I needed, but oh well. Oh, sweet. All I had was nothing but trainer cards in my hand. And I got exactly the card I needed to recover from that, because I can draw cards until I have six in my hand. This will be good. This will be nice. All right. I really enjoy that <laughs> doing that damage. Well, actually, this one's even better. Yeah, that actually saved anyway. me. This hard charm, I would have died otherwise. Yeah, it would have. 
That thing saved your butt. <laughs> and let's see, that's my war turtle? Yep, knew it was my war turtle. Alright, let's pull some energy back out of the discard pile. And give you a proper send-off. That works for me. So, from just this, what do you think of this deck? Uh, it's not bad. It needs a lot better energy search. You probably should do four professor's yeah. letters. I actually only have, like, one of them. <laughs> one professor's letter. Yeah, but, I mean, if you get them, those would be definitely something else that would help yeah. you. I, had, I believe I have one of them in my deck, but that's about it. Well, there's my other Blastoise. It doesn't help me any, though. And there's 210 but, and damage. Right, I'm putting those in the deck when I'm able to. Yeah, it's not a bad deck. It's definitely got the power, it's got the annoying... Those skunk tanks are great. Those are... You can use those as yeah. shields, plus you can destroy energy-rich creatures with them. Mm-hmm.